Gas prices around the valley are continuing to rise, but it's not just hurting your wallet. See how the world's first food bank is dealing with this huge increase in fuel costs. For over five decades, St. Mary's Food Bank in Phoenix has gathered and distributed food throughout the valley. In 2010 alone, they distributed over 74 million pounds of food into the community. However, recently it's been hard to keep all of their transportation trucks fueled, especially since gas prices are so high. St. Mary's Food Bank hopes to run like a well-oiled machine. We distribute about 250,000 meals every day. Manned by volunteers and staff members fueled by donations from the public and local grocers. St. Mary's travels all around the valley to collect the food they need to keep their engines moving. If you're driving down the street, you'll see that St. Mary's truck. They're probably headed to or from one of those grocery stores. But these machines need to be fueled too. In a very short period of time, a lot of money that was allocated toward feeding the hungry now has to be burned up in a gas tank. Half a million dollars is budgeted a year for the fuel, but with the recent spike in gas prices, St. Mary's will go over budget by a significant amount. When you're dealing with $3 a gallon gas and all of a sudden you're dealing with four, that's a 25% increase in what it takes to go and get that food. For every dollar donated to St. Mary's, the food bank can distribute seven meals into the community. But an unexpected $200,000 hit to their budget means that 1.4 million meals this year won't be going out the door. We say the state average is 384. That, mean, that means that there are some stations that are already well above that. There are some stations that are well below that. Michelle Donati with AAA says this number may continue to rise. A scary proposition for a nonprofit like St. Mary's. We really don't have any other way of picking up that food. 96% of any monetary donation made to the food bank goes to feeding the hungry. But Brown says in order to keep the food bank functioning, this percentage could get smaller. The real concern is what's it going to be like in the summertime? What's it going to be like in the fall? We hear talk of $5 gas. Despite the cost of gas, St. Mary's has a mission. Our, our goal at St. Mary's Food Bank is to feed the hungry. And Brown says this bump in the road will not keep the food bank from trucking on. And now according to AAA, gas prices are still on the rise. In Phoenix today, you'll pay around $3.93 per gallon at the pump, about 40 cents higher than the average a year ago, which was at $3.54. Now, these prices are just daunting for nonprofits just like St. Mary's, but the good news is that St. Mary's survived a similar time when gas prices reached a record-breaking high in 2008. Drivers then were paying a staggering $4.15 per gallon.